My name is Ahmed al I'm a third year medical student at the University of Nicosia. Can I quickly confirm your name and date of birth, please? James Luca. All right, uh, very nice to meet you. Can I get your date of birth, please? 31st of May, 1988. And how would you like to be addressed as James, okay? Yeah. All right, James, today I've been asked by, by my supervisor to come in and perform an ABG analysis. Have you ever had one of these done before? No. Okay, so, so it essentially involves taking a tiny amount of blood from one of your wrist arteries and run it through an analyzer, an analysis machine, so that we can see how well your blood is being oxygenated. How does that sound? Okay. Uh, it might be slightly uh, painful, but it shouldn't be too painful. If there's, any, uh, if there's any severe pain, you can always let me know if, and we can stop, okay? Mm -hmm. Since I'm a medical student, I am being supervised, so my supervisor might need to repeat this procedure if I fail to do so. Are you still happy to proceed? Yep. Yeah. Okay, are you in any pain at the moment? No. Would you like a chaperone during this consultation? No. Okay, excellent. I'll just go ahead and gather my equipment, okay? And before we begin, I do want to ask you a couple more questions, if that's okay. Sure. Are you on any blood thinning medication? No. Okay. And are you allergic to latex gloves? No. And do you have a phobia of the needles? No. Okay. I guess you don't particularly like them, but you know, it's not a phobia. Okay, perfect. So we're checking the patient's name, make sure that it matches the patient's description. Perfectly fine. And before we get started, I, I, there is a couple of things that I would like to do. One of them is inspecting the arms. Do you have a preferred arm? Use the left one. The left one. Okay, perfect. So I'll go ahead and inspect the arm. I don't see any signs of infection like cellulitis. There is no swelling or edema. I don't see any wrist fractures. I don't see any AB fistulas or skin grafts that are visible. Have you ever had recent operations on your arm? No. Okay. Excellent. Okay, so as I said, before we get started, what I'm going to do is I'm going to perform a special test called Allen's test, okay? Since I'm going to be taking blood from one of your arteries, I do want to make sure that the other artery is perfectly fine so that it will be uh, able to supply your hand collaterally in case uh, there is a problem with the radial artery, okay? Sure. So I'm just going to ask you to make a wrist for me. Excellent. So I'm just going to go ahead and occlude both the radial and the ulnar arteries. And you can open your fist for me. And I'm going to release the ulnar. And we can see that the nice and, color, nice and red color is coming back. So this is perfectly fine. This is a positive Allen test, so we can proceed with the procedure. Are you happy to proceed? Yeah. Okay, excellent. I'm just going to grab my gloves. And palpate the radial artery. So how are you doing otherwise? How is your day going? besides being in the doctor's office and getting your blood drawn. Okay. All right. Okay, this will be over soon, so fear not. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go ahead and insert this needle into your artery, and it will feel like a sharp scratch, okay? Sharp scratch. And I only need about half an ml, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get this done, perfect. Could you apply some pressure for me here? Please apply pressure for about five minutes.
There's no excess air, so I don't need to do anything. I'm just gonna cap this and gently rotate it so I can heparinize the blood so it doesn't clot. And I will place the tape over your hand and I will come back in five minutes to check back up on you. And I'm gonna run this through the analysis and we'll get back to you with the results shortly, okay? okay. Thank you very much. Thank you.